Hello everyone and welcome to my holiday special here on my YouTube. I decided that we would have to do something festive. We had to do something with a little bit of pizzazz and we had to do a game. So I decided what better game for that than Overwatch. Even as a Christmas event and everything, it's perfect. And what better game mode than Yeti Hunt? We'll play as the Yeti. We will hunt down all the predatory scientists searching us down to kill and maim us for data, for science. We'll crush them beneath our palms and chew on their bones. Nothing will stand in our way! Oh, or we could be May this time. You know, that's not quite as good as killing and maiming, but I can deal with it. Okay, May twice in a row. It's not too bad. I think I've been playing for 20 minutes at this point without getting Yeti. It's kind of ridiculous at this point, Blizzard. Oh, oh, poor baby Winston. I, I, I didn't want this to happen to you. Ah, oh, finally, we're Winston now. It's time to pummel the enemy. It's time to obliterate them. Oh, well, you know what? You know what? Screw this game. Screw this game. How about we play a game that can actually handle the latest graphics drivers 100% of the time? That's right, we're gonna be playing Hitman. Now you guys might be thinking, well this game doesn't seem very festive. You would be wrong in that assumption because they do in fact have a Christmas map. And that's what we're going to be playing today. Originally I had actually recorded a Kill Everyone challenge actually where I played as Santa Claus, but I found out that my microphone didn't record during that recording, and I also found out that it was just really boring overall. So this time we're going to be doing a fiber wire only, suit only, silent assassin run of this map. For this map, what I'm planning to do is get rid of Marv first, and then Harry. Harry usually sticks around the bottom of the map. Whereas Marv usually likes to stand at the top. And that is what I'm putting into consideration, or taking into consideration, when I'm planning this out. I want to kill Marv first. And I know exactly how I'm going to do it. I want to be using this specific suit. So I can't start in the Iago auction. That would make it a lot easier. But I mean, this is pretty easy too. This lady has an invitation on her. And Valerie, all you have to do is bump her and she'll stop talking so this lady can leave. I don't actually need the door closed, so... Yeah, people take so long to show up that you can literally just take her out. You don't even have to shut the door behind you. Ah, darn it. I went the wrong way. But it doesn't even matter because we're gonna have to wait a little bit. There it is, my good sir. Thank you. Please proceed. Good evening, sir. Please come in. Thank you. Have a good one, sir. Okay. And from here, this is where a bit of waiting comes into play. I don't know why, sometimes that guy is standing in a completely different spot. Just 
Just go away, dude. Again, specific timing, not really that big of an issue. I've tried multiple times to get Marv, I suppose, into a vulnerable position. without having to wait for him. It has not worked, and I've tried it quite a few times. So trust me when I say, if it's possible, it is very, very difficult. And yeah, that's actually something that I barely ever notice, which is the fact that he actually throws coins over there. I don't know why I went to pick them up initially. I don't need to. There's no point. Also, there's no point in him even throwing them. It's not like he uses them as a distraction. He runs past all the guards anyway. They don't even care that he's there. He's clearly allowed to be here. Gotcha. Oh, my, my bad. I suppose it was Harry. I wanted to take Harry out first because he was at the top. Now we're going down. There are some people I knock out just so that they aren't a possible nuisance. And that was one of those examples. Ah, darn it. I wasn't sure if I could time it so that it worked out better. I do actually have to peek into the security room really quick. Okay, got rid of the cameras. And I do know... Ooh. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I'm gonna go right out the front. That's okay, Perfect. I didn't even realize he went into that bathroom, to be honest with you. But yeah, sorry if that was confusing to you at first. I knew who I was going after, I just mixed up their names. Okay, nice. That was a nice clean run.
Since I can, I'm just gonna look at this. Huh. Nice poetry there. Oh, this is... Well. By the way, if you're wondering why I have such a weird setup, it's because I... When I was doing Colorado Professional Mode, which I finished, I was just doing it for the memes after a certain point. Like, when I was going for the last few achievements, I was killing everyone on the map just to get those achievements. Got my setup. I don't even know who the guy is. He's clearly one of the standard militia members. I just don't know where is he. Santa's about to spread the Christmas joy to his buttocks. Okay, let's actually look on the map. Oof. Okay, okay, okay. That is not an easy place. Oh. Okay, okay, I see. I didn't remember that one. Okay, now we know that he's, like, in the middle. Ooh, actually, the old orchard does sound like a good starting position. Okay, so no pacifying or subduing. That makes things a lot more difficult on every front. Yeah, just keep on walking, my dude. Might as well get an apricot. Ah, oh, there are two apricots right here. Just for distractions if I need them. I'm just waiting for you guys to move. Then Santa will be on his way. On his merry way. Ha ha ha! Seriously, though, he's right in the middle. And they expect me to do this in a suit. I'm just waiting for our personal guards to leave. Or, rather, for her to leave, Penelope. She very much gets in the way. I wish I could just tell who this guy is. Okay. Hey, what are you doing here? No, 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 you are way out of bounds, sir. Command, target is surrendering. You're secure. Hands high, elbow low, move your head. Take him down. Okay, okay, okay. We're doing this. We are. Trust me. You are not the Spec Ops. The Spec Ops are back there. Okay. That guy noticed me abnormally fast. Actually, I think I have an idea. 
if I time it right while he's walking by, I think I can get the Spec Ops. Uh, no, not Spec Ops. I think I can get the guys who stand in front of the barn. I think I can get them to be his escort guards. Okay, okay. <clears throat> See, I tried something, it did not even come close to a success. I don't know why I did that. I'm pretty sure now one of them's definitely going to blow it up. I'm sure one of them smokes. Yep. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. Wait, hold on, why am I compromised? You know what, I don't think this is gonna work. Okay, now we're done. I am done trying this one. This is a bit too hardcore for me. <laughs> I don't know how to distract every single person so that I can get over into that building. Because that building is the only possible way that I could reasonably take him out without anyone seeing and even then, there are people who are in the building who I'm not allowed to pacify or kill. So, I suppose that's it. So, I hope you all enjoyed the video, and I wish all of you a Merry Christmas. Oh, and as with all my recent videos, there is indeed a teaser ready for you right now. Let's get it.